So the history of the outreach program started when I started here oh, 25 or 26 years ago. I remember taking my kids on Friday nights uh, and standing on the sidelines at some of the high school events just to provide medical care and I knew there was a need and it wasn't being provided. Fortunately, with the support of the hospital administration, we've been able to grow this program. We now employ eight athletic trainers. We cover four high schools. We also provide medical care for other events, such as the Ogden Marathon, uh, the U.S. Xterra Championships, uh, the U.S. Masters and Collegiate Cycling Championships. Also, Weber State University, the Ogden Mustangs, and other recreational um, activities that are brought into town by the Ogden Convention and Visitors Bureau. Uh, several years ago, as I was at the Ogden Marathon, a fellow was just standing outside of our tent after he had finished the marathon. He was watching what we did. And he walked up to me after a few minutes and he said, I'm an emergency room physician and I've run marathons all over the country. And I want you to know that I'm as I'm standing here watching, I've never seen a team work as effectively in a more coordinated way and provide the excellent care your team has today. Our athletic trainers at the high schools in particular are really an extension of the physicians. Our trainers have physician phone numbers if they've got an injured athlete and there's a question about it. It's just a phone call away where we can have sports medicine physicians on the phone to help make decisions about whether the athlete needs to be transported or can be dealt with on the field. That's got to be a comfort not only to the athlete but the parents of athletes as well.